What's going on guys, Balkan Architect here and in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to download and install a free student version of Revit 2020, so the latest version of Revit on your computer. And it's going to be a simple process, it's absolutely free and you can just follow along and get Revit on your computer today and the latest version so you can stay up to date. But before I get started I would just like to ask you to like this tutorial, it helps me out a lot and if you haven't already I suggest you subscribe because I make useful Revit tutorials each week. Also if you're learning Revit and if you would like to check out a cool course that covers the whole building from start to finish, I suggest you check out the first link in the description to that. Okay, with that out of the way, let's get into downloading and installing Revit 2020 on your computer. So here I am at Google and what you're going to do is just type in uh, Revit free student download so just type in something like that and you're going to get to the autodesk education page for uh, uh, students and educators so for students like you or educators like me this is where you can find your version now here i'm already logged in so i'm just going to choose a version of Revit, so I'm going to go with Revit 2020, and for my operating system I'm using uh, Windows 64-bit, so let's choose that, and for a language let's go with English. Okay, so I'm all signed in right now, so what you can do now is just go ahead and install. Here you're going to get some basic information, but that's not so important, and just go here to install now. And it's as easy as that. You just go to I accept. Of course, you're going to read all of this as I have read right now and just install. Okay, there we go. And it has started the download. Once it has downloaded, you just open that thing up and you go to run. Okay, so let's go with yes. Let's allow Revit to make changes on our computer. Okay, so it's going to start installing something and downloading elements. Okay, so here, this is the important part. You want to make sure what is getting installed on your computer. So just make sure that all of these are checked and also open up these content libraries just to make sure that only the US Imperial as well as the US metric is being installed. Or you might want to change that to your country if that's what you choose. I like to have both the Imperial and the metric library and just make sure that you only load those uh, just because it's uh, it's a lot simpler uh, when you have just a few families so you don't have to uh, so you don't have all of these it would take up extra space on your computer and also make if they're not checked you're not going to get any of the content libraries and then working in Revit is going to be actually quite hard. Okay, I'm just going to minimize this and then just check here, install. Now this process might take a while because Revit is first downloading something, then installing, then downloading, then installing. So depending on both the speed of your computer as well as the speed of your internet connection, it, it's going to take a different amount of time for the overall process to finish. And there we go, it's finally installed, so I'm just going to hit finish. And now we have to restart the computer, so then I will just continue off when this is restarted. And there we go, it's done. So here it is on my desktop, so it, if I just double click and wait for a second, here we go, Revit 2020 installed. Okay, I was a bit too enthusiastic, <laughs> it's going to take a while to, for it to start. Okay, so here we've got the privacy statement, let's just agree whatever that says. Ooh, and it looks completely different. Okay, I'm really excited to start working in this new uh, Revit 2020. And how about you guys? So tell me in the comment section below, have you installed this uh, program or are you about to? And yeah, if you want to learn Revit, again, as I said, course is the first link in the description of this video. Okay, so there are going to be a lot more new tutorials in Revit, Autodesk Revit 2020. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this quick tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share this video. And if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for any future tutorials, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.